back to the ranch, Dr. Uptown here. This will be my uh, video response to PR Chico 520's 1000 sub contest. Uh, congratulations, brother. Uh, in that, he's asking uh, what our one firearm and or knife or alternative weapon would be for the uh, zombie apocalypse. And I've done several of these over the year or so, and uh, I kind of always come up with a different thing and or a different weapon to use and uh, a valid reason for it. But uh, I, I kind of uh, listening to Ebomi the other day, kind of uh, came across the epiphany, if you will, that it's not so much about the weapon as the capacity. And so, anyway, I've got my uh, Saiga AK out here couple 30 rounders for it and uh, as far as my blade is concerned not much of a knife guy but uh, this one has some uh, sentimental value and it's a buoy knife uh, appearing leather holster thing uh, got this from my grandfather after he died and, uh, he had made the uh, leather case for it what this is is actually I'm not sure what it's off of I probably would suspect it's uh, from a Springfield 1903 but it's actually a bayonet it's got the US stamp on one side and 1901 date on the other side and uh, obviously over the years it's uh, taken some use and abuse but uh, not being much of a knife guy this is my uh, blade that I do have uh, like I say I've got other pocket knives and stuff but uh, I think for a zombie apocalypse you need a good old cold American steel knife of some sort or another I want to congratulate you on a thousand subs uh, I'm very near that benchmark myself and actually am running my own sub contest so uh, if you uh, feel the need to come over and uh, join in with mine also that would be great um, as far as uh, everything else is concerned you got great videos brother and uh, keep up the good work I'll uh, keep following what you put out anyway this will be my uh, entry into your contest and uh, hope all you guys find this interesting we'll talk to you later you have a good day